Hi friends, I hope you are enjoying this series of free RTOS with Arduino. So today we are going to learn how to use Q in free RTOS using Arduino. So let us see step by step. Before moving ahead for program, we will know about Q. Q are used for data communication between task to task, task to interrupt and interrupt to task. Okay. This is Arduino IDE. We will write here program. So first of all, I will include Arduino free RTOS library. So let's include Arduino underscore free RTOS dot h. Okay. Now I will include q dot h. Okay. So first of all, I will create a q handler. So it will be q. handle this would t and it will be data queue because we will send a data from one task to another task okay we will use serial dot begin with nine six double zero baud rate okay here we will create queue so x queue this is queue create function okay first argument length of data so here it will be 5 so data length will be 5 and size of one data so i am sending here int so it will be size of okay now i will create here two tasks one task is center task and another task is receiver task so x task create okay this is function name and here task name center task and stack size i will take 100 byte parameters is null priority is 1 and handler is null ok same I will copy and paste so it will be receiver task ok ok now we will create here function center task function we will initialize here void and void okay one while loop we will take one while loop it will send continuously data okay so to send the data there is function xq send okay okay one thing is missing here we will assign here in data queue variable okay so we will copy and we will paste here okay after that we will send here value I will initialize here value variable it is in type and I will initialize here with 300 ok this is ampersand here delay I will consider port max delay ok sender task function is created now I will create here receiver task void ok we will declare here one variable it is in type name is receive value ok and I will take 
one while loop it will continuously receive the data and print okay so x q receive okay and copy and paste here copy and paste and maximum delay okay so here received data is assigning here in received value so i will print here on serial serial dot print ln only print and here received value okay i will print here received value okay and one millisecond delay will be there so we task delay okay so now code is ready now i will compile and upload this code so i am using here arduino you know it is connected with my system and i will upload okay okay now again upload the code open terminal yeah you can see it is printing here so once i will explain you how it is working so there is one task sender task here it is sending continuously 300 okay and there is another task receiver task so this task is receiving and assigning into received value okay that value this is sending 300 value integer value and it is receiving here in receiver task and printing here from receiver task okay so i hope you understood this video and lecture if you have any doubt so please uh, ask question in comment box and please do like subscribe and share thanks for watching